Here are my week 14 predictions for this NFL season. Starting off with the Thursday night game, we have the 10-2 Oakland Raiders at the 9-3 Kansas City Chiefs. This one's really a toss-up game. And since the Chiefs are a 1-1 against the Oakland Raiders, I'm going to go with the Oakland Raiders. I don't think the Chiefs will sweep them this year. So the Oakland Raiders win this one in a close one, 31-30. Starting off the Sunday games, we have the 7-5 Pittsburgh Steelers at the 6-6 six six Buffalo Bills. I'm going to go with the Bills. They have a better defense than the Pittsburgh Steelers. And they're both pretty even on offense. I would give the edge to the Pittsburgh Steelers for the passing game and the edge to the Buffalo Bills for the running game. And I think the defense will really make the difference. That's why I'm going with the Bills to win this one 27-24. The 8-4 Denver Broncos are at the 6-6 six six Tennessee Titans. I don't see this one being an upset. The Tennessee Titans cornerbacks are weak enough for uh, Trevor Simeon to find an open man downfield. So they're not really going to stop the Broncos from putting up that many points. And the Broncos defense is good enough to hold Tennessee to only a few points. So uh, I'm going to go with the Broncos when this one 17-14. The 6-5-1 Washington Redskins are at the 5-7 Philadelphia Eagles. I have the Redskins winning this one. The, I lost all faith in the Philadelphia Eagles after uh, they got blown out by the Cincinnati Bengals. This team's weaknesses have been exposed. And Washington still looks like it can be a playoff team. So I'm going with the Washington Redskins to win this game 28-24. The 5-6-1 Arizona Cardinals are at the 7-5 Miami Dolphins. I'm going with the Dolphins in this one. The Arizona Cardinals aren't really that impressive. And the Miami Dolphins still have a shot at the wild card. I don't really see the Arizona Cardinals slowing Jay Ajayi down enough for them to possibly pull off a win here. So the Miami Dolphins win this game 24-21. The 6-6 six six Minnesota Vikings are at the 2-10 Jacksonville Jaguars. The Minnesota Vikings are going to win this game. The Jacksonville Jaguars are fighting for a top draft pick right now and I don't really think that they want to win at this point. So Vikings won this game 20-17. The 6-6 six six Houston Texans are at the 6-6 six six Indianapolis Colts. I believe this game is for uh, the number one rank in the NFC or the AFC South. I think that's depending on uh, if the Tennessee Titans win or not. But I'm going to go with the Colts. The Houston Texans don't really look that good right now. I think J.J. Watt is finally catching up to him. They're missing him a lot. And Brock Osweiler continues to struggle. So Houston Texans doesn't look like a playoff team. And I'm going with the Colts to win this one. 34-27. The 5-7 and seven San Diego Chargers are at the 4-8 and eight Carolina Panthers. I think uh, Phillip Rivers is going to throw all over that weak Carolina Panthers secondary, which will make an easy win for the San Diego Chargers to win this one 37-30. The 4-7-1 and one Cincinnati Bengals are at the 0-12 Cleveland Browns. This might be a game that Cle the Cleveland Browns can win, but I don't see Cincinnati giving it up that easily. Browns are going 0-16. Cleveland wins this one 27-14. The 3-9 Chicago Bears are at the 8-4 Detroit Lions. This is going to be my upset of the week. I'm picking the Bears. They're going to win this game 20-19. to 
the three and nine New York Jets are at the one and eleven San Francisco 49ers. The San Francisco 49ers losing streak will continue after this game. The Jets win it 17-13. The five and seven New Orleans Saints are at the seven and five Tampa Bay Buccaneers. I'm going with the Buccaneers in this one. They've really impressed me lately. And I think they're going to take the NFC South. So the Buccaneers win this one 27-26. The 7-5 and five Atlanta Falcons are at the 4-8 and eight Los Angeles Rams. Falcons are going to beat them easily. The defense isn't going to be able to hold the Falcons down long enough for the Los Angeles Rams to put any points on the board. So the Falcons won this game 27-20. The 8-3-1 Seattle Seahawks are at the 6-6 Green Bay Packers. The Seattle Seahawks are going to win this game. The Packers haven't really looked that good recently. Well, I mean, they've won a couple games, but... Aaron Rodgers isn't going to be able to carry him this game. The Seahawks' defense is too good, and their offense is just good enough that they're going to be able to put points up against this weak Green Bay Packers defense. So Seattle Seahawks won this game 30-27. For the Sunday night game, we have the 11-1 Dallas Cowboys at the 8-4 New York Giants. This game will be my lock of the week. I'm going with the Dallas Cowboys to win it. I think they're going to win out for the rest of the regular season. Cowboys won this game 30-24. For the Monday night game, we have the 7-5 Baltimore Ravens at the 10-2 New England Patriots. This game should actually be a pretty good matchup. It's going to be pretty fun to watch. The Baltimore Ravens defense against the New England offense led by Tom Brady. But I think Tom Brady is going to get just enough done to beat the Baltimore Ravens 27-26. And that will wrap up my week 14 predictions. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe.